Okay, you guys, as promised, I'm going to show you my bedroom for 2021. So starting off with this wreath. Isn't it so pretty? I'm going to leave the um, Instagram handle on the screen. So go check them out. They make some really pretty wreaths. I added lights to mine and it's popping. Then I have my, um, this is my dresser, but I have my perfumes down there because I'm really into perfume now. And um, I got this basket from Burlington for real cheap. It was like a couple of dollars. And um, I went to a spot to display my perfume without risking Jacob like touching them and stuff. So he hasn't noticed it because it's laying in the basket, but I can still see it and be like, ooh, I want this one. All right, so y'all don't care about no perfume. Anyway. I got the red velvet candle and this really cool candle holder that I got from Bath and Body Works this year. Bath and Body Works has been killing it the last couple of years with their candle holders. But um, if you want to see my candle, ooh, I'm not trying to be on camera. If you guys want to see um, my candle haul, then I will link that. I got my um, diffuser going. It smells like spearmint. There are my, my oils right there. So yeah, I just put some lights around my mirror and it's a whole vibe, y'all. Hold on, it's a whole vibe. Look at that. Oh my goodness. All right, so here's the first tree. I changed it up this year. I've had that tree looking the same for like the past five years and I was over it. So I turned it into a rainbow tree this year and I'm so excited. This used to be my sock monkey tree with all the like really bold colors that everybody used to like. I had to change it though y'all. I kept some of the ornaments but I also changed it and brightened it up with lighter colors. I love that rainbow ribbon. It's actually not Christmas ribbon at all. Um, I got it out the craft section at Michael's and it was really hard for me to fold into the it was really hard for me to fold it into the tree but I managed to do it it's a little squished because it's, it's hitting my bed but um, yeah I love how I did that and um, that's just a tip like you don't have to use Christmas ribbon use whatever you like but I'm trying to figure out what that thick ribbon is even for like because you can't really fold it, you can't bend it. So I'm like, what is that thick ribbon even for? You can't tie it up. I guess it's for a tree, baby. Baby. I love this. Alright, so I put some lights on my headboard. I love doing that. It's just, it's a vibe, especially when the lights are off and you just have the headboard lit up. It's really nice. Okay, so... I love this. I'm calling this my princess tree. Look how pretty that is. I had a big fat blue tree last year that I wasn't really feeling, but I like this one this year. This is a completely different tree. I got it from Home Depot this year. And, um, yeah, I'm, I'm digging the pink and the white and the silver, honey. That blue was not cutting it. And that tree was definitely not cutting it. Okay, here is another tree. I love this tree. Now, okay, this tree is the exact same how it was last year. Oh, let me get this thing in focus. Okay, so this tree is the exact same as it was last year, except I added this dark pink um like what do you call this like a dark pink whatever the heck and it totally transformed the tree the tree looked completely different now it's the same tree but it looks different because of that pop of color and i love that i'm like wow that is nice so i'm glad i did that added some lights around the door frame then we have let's check out underneath my tv because this is real nice so we have all of this going on. I added fake snow this year to my little tree. And I like the I like the look it gives. It looks kind of funky on camera, but in person it looks really cool. That's the only thing I don't like about filming things. It's like it looks way better in person. 
you really can't get the the feel, the vibe on camera. I love this, especially when I'm watching Christmas movies. It's really pretty. Okay, y'all. So, I used to call this my princess tree, but now that I have this tree that really looks like a princess tree and it's super light now this is just my little my girly my girly pink tree but homie look at that yes i love decorating with boas i just think they add so much to a tree and um they look really pretty. They they make the tree slightly thicker and fuller. They give the tree texture and it's just it's nice. So yeah, if you don't want to use ribbon, try a boa. And they have boas in all different colors, all different shades. They also make them with patterns now. Which is really cool. If you guys um, watch my Halloween videos, I had like a pattern boa for my Halloween tree. And I love that. Okay, so here's my main tree. It's the exact same as it was last year, but slightly less ornaments. And, um, and it has more lollipops. But it has less ornaments because I had to put some of the ornaments on this tree and that tree so yeah and i didn't i didn't go out and buy any more ornaments so to you guys it's probably like a full tree but to me in person i'm like uh, it's incomplete but it's too late now everybody's uh taking their christmas things out the store like over here you need some pigs that's empty like that's empty over there there's no tree topper but I'm not about to I'm not about to worry about that y'all cuz my tree is still popping so then I have a pretty I have a pretty blanket from Macy's and I would show y'all my mini fridge but I don't have anything on it so yeah last year I had a really cute display where I had like cookies and stuff and I was gonna do an even prettier one with like macaroons and stuff but yeah yeah oh I'm breathing heavy Phew. if you're a Christmas lover subscribe to my channel because we need to connect and be friends Oh, I have my fan over there too, but yeah. Christmas lovers, leave a comment below. What's your favorite part about Christmas? If you guys want to see how I turned my room into this masterpiece, then check out my last video where I did a complete room transformation. I painted it in here. It was gray. I painted it white. I also put away my Halloween decorations. And then I pulled out all these trees and decorated so it's like this huge time lapse. I'll link it at the end of the video. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.